Yo, 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 what's going on guys, your boys Pilot 2K7 coming back with another Coastal Callouts video here in Granite Photo 5. Today we're going to be taking the boat out for a spin. We're going to go ahead and take out the response boat medium. We're at the uh, Coast Guard dock station. And uh, if you guys are new to this series, this is all thanks to PNW Parks fan Coastal Callouts, which is a mod for LSPDFR. It's still in the... Uh, beta testing phase it is an open beta so if you'd like to Attention try it out for yourself Lincoln, you can by um, checking out the links down below in the video description so anyway guys we're at the docks here um, I'm gonna show you guys some of the different boats we have over here let me see if I can run over here really quick we have three different boats at this station so if you look over here we have the motor life boat holy crap and I end up in the water but it's not a close to call outs episode until I end up in the order, I guess. So <laughs> this is our motor lifeboat. This is one of the larger boats that we have in our fleet at this station. This thing could uh, flip itself over. If it like flips over, it could ride itself up, which is pretty cool. And um, it's, it could pretty much handle anything that we throw at it, which is pretty awesome. Um, I'm not going to be taking that out today, though. We have pretty calm seas, nice weather. So we're going to go with the response boat medium. As you see, we also have some helicopters stationed here as well. I see some pilots over there as well standing by, which is pretty cool. And also, if you notice when we were driving in, there was two um, Coast Guard signs. So let's go ahead and get on this one. This is a response boat medium. Ouch. Oh my god, did I still end up in the water? <laughs> Alright, so let's get on to this one. Oh my god. Cut. <laughs> Alright, so let's get on to this one here. Our partner is already inside. He was waiting for us. What's going on, Burner? Are you ready to go? Alright, cool. So he's ready. We have this really cool compartment down here. I'll see if I could show you guys it really quick. That menu? What's my menu button? I'll show you guys the inside. So this is just a little compartment. We could keep uh, people that we rescue down here, people that we arrest down here. We have extra rescue equipment. It's pretty cool. And we have our seats up here as well. But um, yeah, this is definitely one of my favorite vehicles. My favorite bolts that comes with Coastal Callouts right now. And um, yeah, very, very detailed. They did a great job on this thing. We have so many different things on this boat that we could use and really really do like it so let's go ahead and go on patrol we're going to be patrolling in the response boat medium again today and let's see what we get into today so also if you guys have not already watched yesterday's episode make sure you guys go back and watch that that was uh really awesome episodes we had yesterday there goes a defender boat which has been uh, mapped now, so we have multiple liveries. So that's actually one of the newer liveries we have, which is pretty cool. But um, yeah, if you guys have not already checked out yesterday's episode, definitely go back and check it out. I'll put a card up so you can click right now and click, and I'll also put a link in the video description as well. Whichever is easier, so you guys can check out yesterday's video. And um, yeah, I see you guys are excited for Coastal Callouts to be back, so I'm going to try to keep up the Coast Callouts content. I'm going to try to get out videos every Saturday and Sunday for you guys. So if you have any suggestions, definitely let me know on what you guys want to see. Alright, so we're going to be out here um, enforcing the law, making sure nobody's in any restricted areas, doing anything stupid. We're also available if we have to rescue anybody or respond to any serious calls. There's another Defender Bolt right over there. But, um, yeah, let's just head out here and let's see what we get into, guys. Dispatch to all Coast Guard units. We have a fire alarm on a yacht off the western coast. Alright guys, so we're going to report of a fire on a yacht. We're going to go to respond to that. 
So we're going to distress signal, vessel on fire. It's going to be a yacht with an engine room fire near Pacific Bluffs. Crew reports 12 crew and passengers are on board. Respond to the yacht location, meet with the crew and bridge, and determine the best course of action. All right, so this looks pretty cool. I can see the smoke already. It's going to be right here north of us at a yacht. All right, so we're going to go ahead and respond now. This is a really cool call. This is another... Brand new call that PNW Parks fan has put in since the last time we have played. So let's see what's going on. Now we have 12 people on board. We're not going to be able to fit so many people on our vessel if we do have to evacuate them. Hopefully we have a fire extinguisher. I mean we should have one on our ship at least. Wow this is so cool. Alright, so we're arriving on scene. We have a heavy smoke condition here. Alright, definitely need some backup out here as well. Wow, this thing is really on fire. I'm going to try to get a little closer to it. It seems like the uh, fire is coming from the engine room, so I think we are going to be okay to park up next to it here. Oh, looks like the fire's gonna be right here. Alright, so we gotta talk to the captain first. I hear the alarm going off as well. Trying to get just a little closer here. Now we're gonna go ahead and anchor our boat just so that it doesn't move. All right, my partner is going to stay here just in case we have to move the boat. And I'm going to go ahead and make entry onto the yacht here. And I'm going to fall into the water again. No matter how hard I try, man, we just end up in the water. I was trying to just lightly, you know, then it still didn't work. Come on, dude, get up. Oh my god, we are just failing today. <laughs> Alright, so let's head to the bridge first. Oh my god, can we do anything right? <laughs> there we go! Only took us like one minute. Alright, so let's get to the bridge first. Alright, I'm hearing the alarms going off. Is this the engine room or the bridge? Oh shoot. It's really smoky in here. Alright, I think I'm not supposed to go in here first. So I'm gonna get up to the bridge first oh my god there is a lot of smoke here all right where's the captain is everybody okay let's get in here all right so this is where the captain should be at well captain what's going on it says thank you for coming to help all of our alarms are going off. There's heavy smoke coming from the engine room. My technician and I are trying to keep control of the system from the bridge. The other crew member is outside at the muster area trying to keep the passengers calm. We haven't been able to check all the rooms downstairs. Please check every room. Make sure all the guests are evacuated to the muster area. Alright, so we got to get everybody to the muster area. Now, when I went on a cruise before, we actually had our muster area. So this actually brings back memories from our cruises that I went on. There are a total of 12 people on board, including us and the rest of the crew. You have to count how many uh, have already assembled at the muster area, then find the rest. All right, so we got two people up here. Oh, we got to keep talking. After you finish checking the rooms, please go down to the engine room and see if you can put out the fire. There are plenty of fire extinguishers in the engine room. All right, so there's fire extinguishers in the room. All right, thank you for your help. All right, so let's get going. It is really smoky. We got two people in the bridge. Let's do a quick head count. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right, we got eight people in here, so we have four people that are missing. All right, everybody, I'm here with the United States Coast Guard. Oh, shit, I didn't mean to go back in here. All right, everybody, I'm here with the United States Coast Guard. Everybody, you guys are perfectly safe right here where you are in your muster area. I need everybody to remain calm and stay here, okay? Please, nobody leave this area. Everybody stay right here, okay? 
Alright, so they're here. We gotta search for the rest of the people and get them all to the um, muster area here. Oh wait, was I still talking to that guy? I hope I wasn't. Alright, so let's start searching this ship here. I think we should just go straight to the lower level, but I'm gonna just do a quick check over here. Yeah, let's just get to the lower level, okay. It's a really cool call out so far though. Let me know down in the uh, comment section what you guys think so far. All right, let's check down here. Anybody is in here? Coast Guard, is anybody in here? Damn, it's really smoky in there. We need some type of like breathing apparatus here. Alright, checking the bathrooms. Nobody's down here. Oh shoot, somebody's on the bed. Sir, you gotta get up. Sir. You gotta get up, sir. Can I pick him up? Come on, sir. Right, he's moving. The ship is on fire. We gotta go. Sir, the ship's on fire. We gotta go, man. Alright, I'm just gonna grab him here. Let's get him upstairs. So, that's our knife passenger here. Get him out of here. Alright, so we're going to get him to the must area. So that's nine. We still have three more people unaccounted for that we have to find. Oh, I knew that was going to happen. Heck, oh, I'm on the wrong level. I think I gotta go upstairs again. All right, so we got this guy to the muster area. All right, sir, just stay right here, okay? So we still got three more people. Whoa, three more people we gotta find. I got nobody over here. Let's get back to this lower level. Continue our search. So this is where we found the last guy at, right on that bed there. Smoke is serious, guys. Oh, oh, crap, mom. I, I, I gotta get you out of here, mom, okay? You have any clothes you can put on? Oh, lord. <laughs> she doesn't even have her shirt on. Oh, lordy. We gotta get a shirt on this lady here. So we could get a shirt on her or something here. Oop, don't want to zoom in on it. Alright, I can't. Alright, I tried. 
Alright, just cover your eyes, kitties. Cover your eyes. That's hilarious that she has no shirt on, though. Alright, so this is gonna be the tenth person. So we have, we still have two more people unaccounted for, guys. Two more people unaccounted for. This is hilarious. All right, oh, uh, here, you just, just stand here, okay? All right, so our bolt is still okay over there. We just need to find these last two people now. I wonder if any of them are engine in the engine room. Cause they did say two he did say two of his crew members are in the engine room. So I think the last two people are gonna be down there. I was gonna do another quick search down here just to make sure. Oh nope, they we're wrong. Alright, I found the last two people. Alright guys, wake up guys, wake up. All right, at least this needs to have clothes on. Hey sir, can you get up please? Sir, here right, you'll stand in this hallway. I'm gonna come back for you. All right, we're gonna get the lady out of here first. All right, all right, ma'am, stay right here. Do not move. Okay, I'll be right back. Let's go grab that other guy. We're just gonna get both of them out of here at the same time. That's going to be everybody. So we have everybody accounted for. Now we can go down to the engine room and see if we could put out this fire. Alright, sir, just stay right here. I'm going to get your lady friend up. So we got her. And now we just need that last guy. Alright, so that should be 12 people, I believe. If I'm counting everybody right. I believe he told me to count himself and his crew member, I think. Alright, still so a quick head count. So we got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. We got 10 people in here, plus the two people up here. Alright, Captain, I got 10 people in the muster area. Is that everybody? It is? Alright, I'm going to proceed down to the engine room. Alright, I, if I'm remembering correctly, I think that's everybody. I'm going to head down to the engine room now and see if we can get this fire on the control before it spreads to the rest of the ship. Now the good thing about a lot of these ships, they are sealed very well, so you could just close the doors and that would help stop the fire from spreading for a decent amount of time. Eventually, obviously, it's gonna burn through, but. All right, let's uh, go here. Whoa, okay, so we're inside here. I need a fire extinguisher. Some scuba diving gear here. He did say there was an extinguisher down here. Now, I don't see any of the crew down here, so I'm kind of worried that I forgot two people now. Oh, I see these red dots here. I just saw those. There's fire extinguishers here. Okay, so there was fire extinguishers. We didn't have to spawn them. Alright, so let's use this fire extinguisher. Alright, so we just took it off the wall. So yeah, he wasn't kidding. There are plenty of extinguishers down here.
That is fire is really intense. Really need some like uh breathing mask down here. Cause we're in a contained area and all this smoke we would have passed out and I knew I was gonna do that. Wonder how many of these I need to use on this fire. The smoke is just so thick, it's kind of hard to see where exactly our spray is even hitting it. I <laughs> still did it. Alright, we put um four on it. This is gonna be our fifth one if you count the one that we spawned ourselves. Run out of extinguishers down here guys. Alright, so it says good work, the fire has been extinguished. You are ready to leave the scene, press N to end the call out. Okay. So there was two more fire extinguishers um in the back. And once I got the second to the last one, we was able to knock down the fire. As you can see, the fire is knocked down. We literally use almost every single fire extinguisher down here. So let's head back upstairs and let's let the captain know the good news. And the smoke is already clearing some. Wow, that was, that was a really cool call out though. Oh, look at the, the special um, Jayhawk there. I think that's a 100th anniversary or something like that. Special skin over there. We got to use that in an episode one day. All right, so let's report back to the bridge. All right. All right, Captain. The fire has been extinguished. Everybody's going to be okay. Um, I think you, only one out of your four engines has been messed up, but you guys can still... Make it back to the port with the remaining three engines there. Let's go ahead and end the call. Alright, so we just ended the call. We're going to go ahead and head back to our boat now. Oops. Do have baby Ace now at the end of the video. I'm recording this late at night. She just woke up, so she's here with me right now, watching me play. All right, so let's confirm. Okay, so the call out has ended. The smoke has cleared, and yep, there's lots of smoke. So it looks like everybody is going to be okay. The yacht is going to be okay as well, and my partner's still over here. So let's get back to our boat get back on board let's see oh we're gonna definitely end in the water this time there's no way we're making this jump here we go one two three oh oh ouch all right all right partner so let's go ahead and get back into our boat and i think we're gonna go ahead and head back to our our own docks here so i think that's gonna do it for this coastal call episode i really do hope you guys did enjoy 
If you did, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And let me know if you guys want to see more coastal callouts. And let me know what else you guys would like to see. Do you guys want to see more boat rescues, helicopter rescues? Let me know down in the comment section down below. And make sure you guys check out the links down below as well on how you can get coastal callouts a little bit early before it comes out. So anyway guys, thank you guys for watching. Huge shout outs to PNW Parks Fire for putting together this amazing mod. And um, also Skyline GTR Freak for making all these amazing models for us to use as well. So anyway guys, thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed and I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.